going on everyone mario here with out of ds and in today's video i'm going to show you exactly how you can start automating your drop shipping store i'm going to show you how you get started in automation and what the benefits are to automating your entire store now today's video is going to be a fun one so make sure you watch all the way to the end Now, before we get started, if you haven't done so already, please make sure to hit that subscribe button and make sure you ring that little bell notification so you don't miss out on any future videos. Here on this channel, all we do is talk about dropshipping and some of the best ways that you can start growing your business. We cover everything from some of the best products to dropship to some of the best tips and tricks to help you start and scale your e-commerce business. If you want more information on anything that I'm going to be covering in this video, then just go ahead and check out the description down below. There's going to be a link to a relevant article down there. Now, before we get started, actually, I'll automating our stores, let's first fully understand what exactly is automated dropshipping. So dropshipping itself is simply a fulfillment business model. And the reason it's called a fulfillment business model is because that's really all you do. You fulfill orders. So the easiest way that I can put this is somebody comes to your store and places an order for a t-shirt and pays $30. Then all you have to do is just go ahead and contact your supplier, make the purchase and pay $20 for the shirt. Have the supplier send the t-shirt to your customer and then the remaining $10 are your profit. It's pretty much all there is to it. As you can see, there is no inventory. You don't have to ship anything. Your supplier does everything for you. All you have to do is pretty much reroute the order from you to your supplier. So that's drop shipping. Now, what exactly is automated drop shipping? Well, it's pretty much the exact same thing, except with a lot less steps. So this is what I mean. Instead of you having to go to your supplier's website, place the order with your supplier, and then update your customer with a tracking number. Once the supplier gives you the tracking number, it's pretty much all automatically done by whatever system you choose to go with. So whatever software you choose is going to end up doing all the work for you. So really all you have to do is just kick back and really just enjoy the profits coming in. So for one, with an automated dropshipping store, you're pretty much hands off. All of the work is automatically done. Now that also helps in reducing human errors. So whenever you go ahead and place the order with your supplier, there's sometimes a small possibility that you can probably hit an extra one or change one of the numbers in the address. By automating your dropshipping store, you're pretty much eliminating almost any possible error. Another fantastic benefit to automating your dropshipping store is the fact that it's easier to scale your entire business. So what I mean by this is the fact that once you start automating your store, you can start automating your import process as well. So instead of you having to manually import all of the different products to your store, you know, having to save all the different images, copy over the titles, copy over the descriptions, copy over the variations. Sounds like a lot of work, right? It's all automatically done for you. Now doing it manually might be okay if you have maybe two or three different products to import, right? But once you have 10 10, 20, 30, 100 different products, it's literally going to take you days to just finish your imports if you're doing it manually. If you're doing it automatically and you have everything automated, it'll take you at most maybe an hour. And honestly, even then you're not doing any of that work. So you can focus that time on scaling your business or just on another aspect of your business. Now, I know I've been talking a lot about automating your dropshipping store up until this point. So now let me actually start showing you how you can start doing it. So first and foremost, we need to figure out where we're going to be selling. So where are we going to be setting up Shop. Are we going to be selling on a customizable website such as Shopify, Wix, or WooCommerce? Or are we going to be selling on a marketplace like eBay, Etsy, Amazon, or Facebook Marketplace? So for this example, I'm going to show you how you can link your Shopify store. So the first thing that we need to do is go on over to AutoDS.com and log into our account. Now, if you don't have an account with AutoDS, you can start a trial for just $1. So to add your store, the first thing that you need to do is go on up here. For you, it's not going to say Pet Shop Discount. This is just one of the stores that we have linked, but go on ahead and click click on the little edit button. And then down here, you're going to see add store. Go ahead and click on that. Now here, you're going to have a few different stores to choose from. All of these are supported by AutoDS. So if you're selling on eBay, Amazon, of course, Shopify, Facebook, Wix, WooCommerce, or Etsy, then you can enjoy the benefits of automation. You can use AutoDS to automate your entire store. So for this example, we're going to be using Shopify. So let's go ahead and click on that and then click on continue. Then it's going to take us to the app store on Shopify. From here, all you have to do is add the app to your store. Of course, in this example, it's already added. So it's just telling us to open the app and to get started. That's pretty much all there is to it. Now you can start enjoying the benefits of automation using AutoDS. We just went ahead and linked our Shopify account to our AutoDS account. So that's pretty much it, right? That's the end of the video. No, <laughs> definitely not. 
there's tons more benefits and features that you can be benefiting from. So let's go ahead and start checking out some product research as well as importing some products to our store. So let's start with product research. How can you find winning products that are going to sell? Well, there's a few different ways to do this. For one, you can check out your suppliers. So go to your suppliers websites such as CJ Dropshipping or AliExpress and see what products are trending on there. So for example, right now we are on the CJ Dropshipping website. Now this is the homepage. All you have to do is scroll down a little bit and then you're going to have a section that's literally trending products. All of these products have been proven to sell and have a proven track record. So a lot of these are actually doing pretty well on the market. So they're pretty much getting a good amount of sales. Now, aside from that, you can also check out seller recommendations. Now, when I'm talking about seller recommendations, let's check out one of these products. Let's go ahead and look at this one. And on the product page, forget about the product itself and just scroll all the way down. So once we scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. So once we scroll all the way to the bottom, we're going to have recommended products. A lot of the times these products are going to be recommended from the seller themselves. And the reason they're recommended is because they're similar to the product that you're looking at and they also have a proven track record of selling. Another option that you have is the AliExpress Dropship Center. Now on AliExpress, they have this service called the AliExpress Dropship Center, where they show you tons of different items that are, again, currently trending and have a proven track record. Now, the difference here is that they also give you some analytics as well as they tell you how many have sold. So this watch right here has a 4.8 star review and has over 2000 that have been sold. So you know what? I want to add this watch to my store. I think this is going to be a great addition and I think it's going to sell. So let me go ahead and add it to my store using automation. Now you can add this manually and that would require you to do this. So go to each one of these images, then you're gonna have to right click, you're gonna have to save the image, then you're gonna have to go ahead and copy over this description, paste it onto your store. And then you're going to have to go here, copy over this description over here, do the same thing. Go ahead and copy, paste it to your store, make any necessary adjustments. And then as you can see, there's also three different variations. So you're going to have to make three different variations on your store all manually. You can see how this can start to take a lot of time. Now, let me show you how we can completely bypass the entire process and do it in a few simple clicks. So all we have to do here is on the link, go ahead and copy it, or I always cut it. Then let's head on back over to autods.com and let's go ahead and add products. Now here we have the option to either do a single import or multiple product import. Right now I'm only doing one, so I'm going to click on the single product. Here all I have to do is paste the link and you're going to see down here the supplier source is going to be AliExpress and it's going to be shipping from China. Now we can publish it directly to our store and have it go live, but I don't fully recommend that. I suggest going to edit now. So let's do that really fast. Now what happens is the item is going to be added to our draft section. So we can can either make any necessary adjustments now or we can come back to it later so here once we're in the product draft page you're going to have everything that you can customize so for one you can customize the title over here change it to whatever you need to since we are on shopify you can add it to any one of your collections another option that you have is the ability to put tags now these tags can be used for a few different things but primarily you can use them to be able to keep track of different categories for your items so that way you can see how they're selling now everything else is also pretty self-explanatory so you have the different shipping methods you can choose either the cheapest, which will come with no tracking, the cheapest with tracking or the fastest with tracking. Typically, we suggest to just go with the cheapest with tracking because you always want to provide your customer with a tracking number. Then you have the country from which the item is going to be shipping from, as well as the city and a brand. The brand doesn't really matter. Then you have a few other tabs. So we have the description where you can go ahead and edit the description. You have the different variations where you can go ahead and change different aspects of the different variations. So you can change the fee percentage you want to make, how much you want to make in fees rather than a percentage. You can choose an actual dollar amount same thing with the profit profit percentage as well as profit dollar amount or if you want to just go ahead and sell it for let's say fifty dollars you can go ahead and set a fifty dollar price then you have the general option which really just has the details of the item itself aside from that you have the images tab where you can go ahead and delete any images and you're also able to edit them so we have a built-in image editor that can help you edit the images as you see fit so that way they could fit your website a bit better now i showed you a few different suppliers that you can use to be able to start importing products but within the out DS platform, we also have the marketplace. Along with the marketplace, we also have the winning product section. So in the marketplace, you can find tons of different items in a variety of niches. Not only that, but you also have a few different filters as well as a filter for suppliers. So let's go ahead and check out the auto DS suppliers really fast. The auto DS suppliers are absolutely fantastic because for one, they have pretty quick shipping. On top of that, you also have the option to brand. So 
AutoDS suppliers are private suppliers that have signed up to work with AutoDS and they've gone through a rigorous vetting process. So that way you can make sure that you're always going to have high quality items. Now looking over here really quick, you can see that this Bosco Wholesale is an AutoDS supplier. So their shipping time is six to nine business days. Now that's six to nine business days for your customer to receive their order from the time that they place their order, not six to nine business days for the supplier to ship their items. So as you can see, that's some pretty fast shipping. Now, if you look at this one right here, you can see customizable branding. And this one actually ships from the AutoDS warehouse. Over at AutoDS, we are also a supplier. We have our own warehouse with some hot items. So anything that you see that's going to be AutoDS warehouse is going to ship from our own warehouse. Now, as far as the customizable branding, you can go ahead and upload your own logo. So that way your items ship with a custom thank you card with your logo on them. Not only that, but pretty soon we're also going to have custom packaging. So that way the packaging itself can also have your logo. Now let's take a quick look at the winning product section. And in the winning product section, these are actually winning products that have a proven track record. So all of these have been proven to sell and are currently trending, just like in, let's say, the dropship center. Now, the only difference is that let's go ahead and click into this one. Now, the biggest difference actually is the fact that we have analytics on here. So we have a profit analysis so you can see how much is being sold for and what a potential profit is. So you can potentially make up to $31 or even more selling one of these products. You also have a Facebook ad. So this is an actual Facebook ad that's currently running promoting this product. So this can help you structure your own Facebook ads. Now, if you don't know much about Facebook ads and you don't know about audience targeting and all that stuff, don't worry because we got you on that as well. So we also have a target audience section. You can see that this product in particular is geared towards both males and females between this specified age range and with these following interests, eco-friendly products, car enthusiasts, aromatherapy, interior car decoration. And if you want to learn how you can structure your own website, we also have a link to an actual website that's currently selling this particular item. So as you can see, here we have Enra Lizek. I'm not sure if I pronounced that right or not, but this website actually sells the item that we were just looking at. And you can see how the website is structured. Now, let's say I decide I want to actually import this particular product to my store. All I have to do is click on import draft and it's going to go straight to my draft section. Now, one last thing I did forget to mention about the product importing is the fact that you can easily import it to your store and have it go live once you're done making all your edits. And to do that, all you simply have to do is click on save and import. Once you do that, AutoDS will process all of the changes and it'll make it go live on your store ready for customers to make a purchase. Now with AutoDS automation, you also get access to price and stock monitoring. So what that means is the moment that your supplier makes a change to their stock. So let's say a particular item goes out of stock or the price changes, AutoDS will make the necessary adjustments on your store. So that way you don't have to worry about missing out on any money or potentially going negative when a customer makes a purchase. So as you can see here, we have all of the different products listed on our store and you can see that we have the amount that are available, amount that are on hold and amounts that are out of stock. So as soon as something goes out of stock, it will update here and it also make the necessary adjustments to your store's inventory. Another really cool feature that you have access to with AutoDS is price optimization. So what this means is, let's say you have a particular item that's doing really well and selling tons of different units. Well, in that case, you might want to increase your price so that way you can make a little bit more profit. But instead of having to do that manually, AutoDS could do that for you. So looking over at the screen, we have under the settings, the automations tab. So here, all you have to do is click on add automation. Let's name it something generic, just store number two. Then we're going to click on next. And now you have one and set price. So when the number of sales is higher than one, so let's say you sell one item per day, then you can raise the price by either a certain percentage up to a certain percentage limit. So one is a little too low. So I would say maybe five sales in one day then you can raise the price by maybe 2%. Now you also have the same option, but for a dollar amount down here, not just the same way that you can increase your price. If you click next, you can also go ahead and decrease the price if a certain item is not doing too well. So in this case, what we have is when the number of sales is lower than let's say five per day. So if we're selling less than five each day, then we can go ahead and decrease the product price by 2%. Then once we click on next, then you can go ahead and choose all of the different items that you want to apply this automation to. As you can see, this is an extremely handy feature that can help you start to make a bit more money and can easily help you scale your business. Now, what about when a customer places an order? What then? Well, we got you there too. So let's just go ahead and click on over to the orders tab. There's a few different orders that have already been delivered and one that has been ordered from our supplier. So whenever a customer places an order, the order is going to automatically be routed to your supplier. When that's the case, you're going to see 
see ordered. So what ordered means is just that the item has been ordered from your supplier. As soon as it ships, this will immediately change over to shipped. And then once it's delivered, it'll switch over to delivered. Now, in order to do that, of course, you're going to need money to purchase the actual item, right? So you're still going to have to pay your supplier to have them ship out the item. Now with AutoDS, you have two different ways to do this. You have the automatic orders as well as fulfilled by AutoDS. Now automatic orders and fulfilled by AutoDS work in a similar way. So when it comes to automatic orders, what ends up happening is when your customer places an order, AutoDS is going to take your credit card information along with your login details for your supplier. So let's say your item is being sourced from CJ Dropshipping. AutoDS will log into CJ Dropshipping using your buyer account and make the purchase on your behalf. Now with fulfilled by AutoDS, instead of using your buyer accounts along with your credit card details or your debit card or banking details, what's going to happen is fulfilled by AutoDS is going to place the order using the AutoDS accounts. Now this is fantastic, especially if you're sourcing from Amazon or eBay, because it can help you avoid account restrictions. Since you're never going to be logging into those systems using your details, you're not going to have to worry about anything like account suspensions. AutoDS is going to use its AutoDS accounts to make any necessary purchase. Now, as far as the money, instead of using your credit card details, it's going to use a balance that you top up. Now, automation isn't just directly for your store, right? So you can use it to actually automate your ads. Now, aside from all of the benefits that I just mentioned, honestly, automating your entire dropshipping store is probably one of the best things that you can do. Really, at the end of the day, what ends up happening is you just get a ton of time back to yourself. That time you can use to either reinvest into your business or you can take some time off, relax with the family and just kick it. Honestly, at the end of the day, if you could save some time with certain processes, especially the tedious ones, then why not? You're going to be saving time. You're going to be saving money. And at the end of the day, you're going to be making more money because you're going to be able to reinvest into your business to keep scaling. Remember that if you do want to automate your business, then you can try AutoDS currently for just $1 for the trial period. If you found this video informational, if you found it useful, if you found it helpful, please make sure to leave a like. Also, remember to hit that subscribe button as well as ring that little bell notification so you don't miss out on any future videos that can help you scale and grow your business. Once again, my name is Mario with AutoDS, wishing you all nothing but success in your dropshipping journey, and I'll catch you all next time.